Oh, here's baby this morning. Hi, mama. She moves like constantly, just like she did when she was in my belly. She was always like kicking me. And she's just like always kicking. Always kicking. Look at her no toesies. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I could watch you for a lifetime. You know. You know it, don't you? Who's that? The Eliana? The Eliana baby? I got this coffee. I never get these like mixed coffees. I'm sure it's really sweet. That's why I usually don't get them. And I like making my own anyway. So I tried it on its own. Didn't like it. I added milk, almond milk, and I added whipped cream and sprinkles. I just made bacon in the oven. This is the first time I put them on a rack and on a cookie sheet. All right, so this is what we made this morning. I have two eggs and this salsa. I made more green salsa. I swear it's one of the best I've ever like tasted. Um, bacon and tortillas. And these are like those raw tortillas that you cook on the stove. So, and those are so good. I got this at Costco today, curry. And we got some of these. And I'm gonna make some white rice. I'm just gonna warm it up. I don't like it. I've had yellow curry. That's like my favorite curry. I've had pumpkin curry. They are so good. They're all like so good. We've made curry at home a few different times and it turned out amazing. And I'm testing some of these. I'm gonna eat in the dark because our window right here in the front it doesn't, like the blinds don't go down all the way, so. And it's dark outside. So if I have the light on, then everybody can see me. I took the little spinny thing from here and put it in my spice cabinet, just to make it easier to get to the ones that I use the most. Why do I feel so hungry? I feel so hungry. And it's still such a mess in here. Look at what these kids do, these, I swear. They come in here, they eat candies, or snacks, anything. Like they'll eat like gummies or even something. If they eat anything like this or anything, literally. Like look, look, what, water, what? Do they just like stand here and like eat and then run out? Who does that? And another thing, you think these are filled? No, they are not. These are all empty boxes. Every single one of these are empty. Why? Well, no, this isn't actually. Why is this down here? And it's still in here because when the kids finish something, like anything, they leave it in here. Oh, and the baby. Look at, okay, another thing. So pissed off, so angry, so angry. First of all, that's mine. Cameron always uses it and I don't like that. Look at, one, two, three, four, five. Five effing pickle jars. My kids are always the one who wants pickles. Two of these pickle jars were just like in the back back. And if anything's in the back back, it gets frozen. So I just kind of like clean this out today. That's why there's What's pickle jars. Frozen? Nothing's frozen right now, but threw stuff away. And I wanted to make these for the kids. Yeah, but like, I, I don't like fridges. I really don't because everything gets lost in the back. And everything in these drawers down here, like we'll forget about it. Or like they'll be so stuffed that we don't like use half of the shit in there. I don't know. We don't want to go through it every single time. This is empty. I emptied it out because I do not want candies in two different places. Now I don't know what to do with this. I don't know what to put in here. Okay, turn offy offy. I just put some chips in here. Okay, I stripped my bed so I can't like lay down right now. I don't want to get comfortable because I have to finish drying. I've mentioned our ant problem that we've had since we moved in. Yeah, that's just one little ant. There's another one right there. And another one, and another one, and I've probably killed by now. There's another one. Probably a hundred. And this is just in my room. I don't know where they're coming from 
or why because like it's always something somewhere you know it's always coming from something somewhere i don't see a trail and it's not in the trash anywhere they're not on the side they're not inside the trash we bathe with them we sleep with them we eat with them we cook with them sometimes we probably cook them like i'm always afraid to put the baby down anywhere like even on the couch because they're all over the couch too we don't have frames we did at the other house but couldn't bring everything here you know so i can't get new ones yet again i had just moved in to that house when we first moved back to utah and i got frames and beds and then i had to get rid of them it is just really 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 disappointing um nobody will do anything about it like we have to and i've put like so many trap not traps but like bait um you know stuff that's supposed to kill ants in their colony but doesn't really work because they're still here look at how big these pants are they're all the way up to her little chest look at she's so tiny i feel like she's so tiny still today has been kind of like a rough day for her because it is little pants on um yeah so she goes to the doctor in two days and then We'll see. I don't know what he's going to say, but I don't feel like her feedings have been improving at all. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 Hi. Hola. Hi. You want to see? You want to see? There you are. <laughs> yeah, the baby. You want your face painted? Can I paint your face? Or are you too little? Are you too little? You want booby? Get us tetas? Tetas? Get us tetas? Oh. Yeah? So I'm making some leftovers. One, ooh, spooky. So I'm making Beatrix some eggs and tortillas. She wants two eggs. The baby has not had a very good morning and pretty bad day yesterday. So like the way she sucks, she just gets tons and tons of air. Throughout the night, she's always fine. She's standing. She's standing. Woo. So I just fed her. I fed her a little bit. I don't know if she's still like going through it whatever she's going through I don't know she has an appointment tomorrow I made tequilas last night and Spanish rice I'm trying not to eat spicy food because I could eat spicy super super spicy every day the meat in here is pork butt I don't know I honestly don't remember what it was called but it said butt that's the only thing I do remember so I cooked it in the crock pot with potatoes and celery and carrots so that's what all this is. It's potatoes, celery, and carrots, and meat. I just slept like the past three hours. Me and the baby, or I slept with the baby. She's been asleep. She's still sleeping. Um, so she did have a doctor's appointment today. She is nine pounds, eight ounces. Almost three months old. So like, I guess the next step is a lactation consultant and or whichever comes first um a speech therapist i i don't know that i don't know if needed then like some sort of x-rays yeah so i made a lactation appointment and a speech point appointment could it be because she just like doesn't latch like really though could it I don't know, all I know is that she just sometimes seems like she's in so much pain. Even when I don't really think she gets like so much air when she eats, so. Sometimes she does like take in so much air and I can hear it. Sometimes it doesn't seem like she is. Like not a, totally not as much as other times. And she'll still 
have the same symptoms, like just in pain sometimes. This morning she wasn't really eating well. Yesterday, the day before. So like every day I feel like she doesn't like eat normally, whether she has all this pain or not. But the last three days have been worse. Like she's had, she's had a lot of pain. But all the other days, not as much as these past three days. I don't recall anything changing in my diet. She got so scared. I think she's, I think she's getting to the point where she like kind of recognizes or realizes that she's not comfortable in the situation that she's in because all the other times going to the doctor she was fine you know somebody else looking at her touching her she was fine but this time oh my god she was laying down on the table and i walk away i step back a little bit and the doctor comes to her face to face and she like instantly like just turns her head and looks at me she had such a big frown on her face at that moment a frown she looked at him and like looked at me and she got this like instant frown and she started crying a little bit and then once he touched her with like the hell is it called that little heart thingy she started screaming and then after he was done I picked her up and she still had a super big frown on her face like a frown it was so sad but yeah that's the first time she did that I'm gonna add this to the video that I'm doing right now, editing. And I don't upload, like I hardly upload, and I am so sick of, sick of it, I'm sick of myself because I want to. I am like such a mess most of the time. Like sometimes I'll feel like fine and good and something just switches my mood. And there's just like, just all the stuff that is happening right now. I just, it's so hard to be happy. Sometimes I feel so, so hopeless, I, I, I guess. Hopeless, yeah. And I've been working on this video for like three days now, so I'm gonna finish it. So I'm gonna push myself to do three videos in a week at least. I'm gonna do it, I have to do it. I'll hate myself if I don't do it. She's waking up. 